Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Thank you so much for joining me. My name's Mac from LOE. So I thought what we'd do in this episode, we'll just take a little look at the map and head south. And I think we're going to go and see Javier Esquala. Um, so it's a bit of a horse ride. Uh, and this is, we got a tip off from when we were last in Valentine, when we had the fight with that big barn door, Tommy. Uh, we learned from Mr. Trelawney that they had captured Sean in Blackwater and they are planning on moving him. So I think we'll head over there and see if we can get Sean out the brown stuff. Okay guys, we will head that way and we will see you in a minute. How many? A lot. Uniforms everywhere. You see Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? Who knows? Just I... keep your eye. Mm. Where is that little Irish best? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Has anyone been in the black water to see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah. pictures of Dutch. Say, uh, oh, he got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's going to remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. We want to trial him publicly. You're a gentleman? Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. We can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or cut him loose. I'm not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Skeldings, boys. I'm moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Sure, well... We'll rescue Sean, and then we'll get ourselves lost, good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. Come on, boy. Right, so let's go and rescue Sean. So he's with Bounty Hunters at the minute. And we're going to try and get him before they hand him over to the government. Let's head up river and find this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Yes, south of the river, West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. I keep hearing about this woman, Heidi McCourt. Some young mother, they're saying, Dutch murdered on the boat. I don't know about that. I wasn't there. Bad day. And no money yet, it seems. I hope you know where that is, at least. There, look. I think that's our boat. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. I do like Sean. He's an absolute legend. Sean, okay? I know what you two are like. You think they can see us? If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I'm missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll <laughs> never run out of people to rob. But without me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Maybe. <laughs> Anyway, we should keep it down. Come on, let's keep them in sight. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. <laughs> cute, dear boy. Very cute. Right, so we shouldn't actually be in this area because uh, Blackwater's in lockdown since the robbery and murder. So we've got to be careful they're not spotted by Pinkertons. Up, come on. 
So we're taking quite a big risk here. Somewhere around here where uh, the bounty hunters yeah, Sean's a lot worth it. Before continuing out west. He's a funny guy. I imagine that's where they're headed. So obviously something very uh, bad happened on the boat and Dutch murdered a young uh, lady. Uh, but no one seems to know the circumstances behind it. And the money's still in black water. Right, so the boat's just up ahead. Just down there. I do love this game though. Look, Fantastic. Get your binoculars out. Let's see what we're dealing with right, here. Let's get the old binoculars out. Have a little scout around. Let's see what we can see. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skelton's boys, but I hear they're a big crew, wild, built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. <laughs> yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. <laughs> oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Right. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Yeah, Mr. Trelawney's good as well. He's a cool oh, dude. Bloody hell, do you want to watch where you're going? So it looks like there's a couple down here. Might be a bit of a stealth mission, which isn't very good news for me. Not usually very stealthy. All oh, right, so they're just over there. Right, let's see. Let's do this quietly if we can. Leave it to me, gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay? <laughs> do the Crouch dirty. Down out of sight. Right. Take out your knife. Let's get in the river. Wait until he's got them off guard before crossing. Right, okay. Oh, I've not brought my speedos. Gentlemen. Hold up, he's doing his thing. Gentlemen, excuse me. Dear brothers, my wife is taken ill. Gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. You she take the one on the left. Where is she? Right, let's, let's get him. I, I'm beside myself. I, if I lose... Hopefully this is where all my SAS training down. comes into Stop. fruition. I, I can't! I can't! I, I'm having a fit! <laughs> <laughs> let's get him. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Yeah, they're on Javier. A pleasure as always. Well done, Mr. Trelawney. I think you have it from here. Right, he's going to do a runner. Let's see what gun we can get. Oh, carbon repeater. Let's get that. I think there's some more up this canyon, isn't there? So I'll head this way. Come on. We got two halfway up the canyon to deal with. Where are they? Here they are. Come on! We need to get past these sons of bitches! Right, nice. Move on now! Let's move up. Behind this rock here. Oh god, no. Don't get do that. Let's get let's get down. Didn't want to jump on the bloody thing.
security. Not gonna do anything, not him. Up a bit more. Just one by that big ridge there. Got him. Got him. See if we can get down. Get that one running across. Alright, just one up at the top there. Can we get him? Right away, away, I think we got him. Oh, beauty. That was Cliff. Right, let's get a bit higher. Charles, help him out. Hey, watch out for these two. Oh god. Oh, that took his head off. Here's Charles. All good? Wouldn't go that far. The camp's up this way. Come on. Right, so there's going to be a few up here, I think. Charles, Hopefully we'll try and get a bit of a better gun in a bit. Okay. Take him down. Oh, let's go under cover. Goddamn army of these bastards. How much is Sean's bound? <laughs> Still time. Oh, no, we're out of time. Let's get him down. Push forward. Look out. All right, so is that by the water tower? Up a little bit. Jesus. Oh my god, he's seeing him. Ah! Jesus. There he is. There's just a couple around here, I think. Move up a bit. Oh yeah. We got more coming down the hill. Oh, oh I'm right in the knee. Need to get a bit of cover here. On top of the cliff. Are you supposed to be owing you for this one? Takes an army of healthy old girls that were getting shot. Oh yeah. That's how you. Jesus. Oh no, there he is. Heavy work in his <laughs> Anymore? Oh, this rope. <laughs> he hanging by his heels. He's a legend, Sean. <laughs> you know, you're a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. <laughs> Do we get a hug, Arthur? <laughs> a warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. 
You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Okay, come on. <clears throat> Have I got stories for you? Yeah. <laughs> I can't wait. I imagine y'all miss me a lot. But fear not, the joy's back in your lives now. <laughs> right, so that's Sean. So we got him. Oh, we got a tomahawk as well. Brilliant. Right, I think that's where we'll leave this episode. So we got Sean back. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did like the video and you would consider subscribing, that'd be absolutely bonza. But uh, until next time, Earthlings, stay safe and take it easy.